So this is a review of the Bearcat fire pump. Just got this for just over $1,000 Canadian. Pretty good value, I think. Uh, it's not the cheapest one on the market, but it's certainly, um, certainly is worth the uh, investment. So, um, the nice thing I like about this is the cart. This is a pretty wild cart. This thing's 75 pounds, and you can lift it up and cart it around pretty easily. They've got nice big wheels, and uh, it's, pretty, it's pretty accessible, or it makes it pretty accessible, um, I imagine. Most of the other uh, pumps, fire pumps, don't have this. Um, you've got the water take intake, um, which is on the rack here. It's a nice rack as part of the uh, the cart. Uh, there's 12 feet of uh, pipe that comes with it. And then you've got the uh, fire hose, 50 feet of hose that comes with it, which is nice having the hose and all the fittings all included. Um, so Echo makes that. Uh, it's a Honda engine, six and a half horsepower, pretty powerful. Um, you can shoot 85 feet. If you look at my other video, uh, fire hose, Bearcat fire hose test, You'll see uh, me shooting it over our creek. A um, little tricky to start for me. It is a Honda, but um, you've got to play with the choke a bit. Um, you know, put the choke here. See that gray? Put it to the left to start. And then once it's running and hot, turn it back. Um, and there is a, uh, below that, there is a throttle. A throttle there and you'll see the bunny and the, t and the tortoise for the directions so yeah it's pretty um pretty powerful again uh, a couple things to keep in mind you've got to prime it with some water on the top fill this reservoir and that is what it also comes with this little this little uh, jug I did have to wire it because it was uh, running into the wheel and it's kind of an awkward placement but um, use that jug you got the gas, you got the on off switch, um, and you also must empty the tank after you're done, especially in the winter, drain the tank for the reservoir. This reservoir is the most expensive part of this. This is about 400 bucks right here if you need to replace this. So don't forget to winterize. Couplings are pretty good. My only complaint here, two complaints, Plastic nozzle. I mean, it works. It's like a. It's got a fine spray and a wide spray. It is plastic, though. There is a. Looks like a brass fitting in the inside. But just worry about the uh, longevity of that. And the intake. I had issues with the intake. If it doesn't work, if if the motor is not sucking um, water, it's usually because the intake is sucking air. I had to put an extra clamp here. This is stock. This is me adding this. Um, I did that on both ends. The intake here, my own clamp, and theirs. Highly recommend this. This has to be tight. If air gets in here, the motor will not work. It'll time out. It'll get too hot. So, yeah. Overall, for a thousand bucks, great uh, fire safety, forest fire prevention, and uh, highly recommend it.